It takes a few years, usually about a century, for a church, a church organization or denomination to become so entrenched in its uh, monumental bureaucracies and organizational structures uh, that it reaches a point that it is almost incapable of uh, being able to speak to the generation that it is currently living in. Then I thank God, the Spirit of God comes and sends an earthquake of some sort and a fresh new idea, more relevant to the time, less, um, less focused on maintaining, more focused on hearing something fresh and something new, almost like a new living testament. I think that the church the Christian church in the United States particularly is in that place right now. And what we are, are lamenting about, we're calling essentially hemorrhaging from mainline church, is the stuff of Reformation. You know, there are some fresh new ways to be that are more attuned to what our younger people, our young adults, this technological age that we are in, uh, people's ways of now moving from faith to faith, or, or having a, uh, an ability to see the Spirit of God acti actively at work in many spheres and in many ways. I'm watching that happen all over this country, and I sense that we are definitively in a movement from stuck, stayed, concretized, constipated monuments to a, a time of fresh revelation.